hi guys welcome back to my channel my name is Tammy Banjo if it's your first time here you are very welcome I highly appreciate your presence here and if it's not your first time here welcome back thank you so much for coming here once again I honestly honestly really appreciate your presence here and I will never take it for granted so this video is kind of emotional because I have been postponing postponing it for the longest time it's kind of my 2020 vision goals and just a summary lumped up together meanwhile there's a construction going on just beside my house so you might be hearing some noise but at the same time i'm putting on my microphone so i hope that kind of reduces the noise so i have the brain of a goldfish so i am going to be reading from a book because I cannot really summarize or remember everything I'm supposed to talk about so here it goes I started my YouTube video or my YouTube journey in 2017 with absolutely no clue no goal no vision as time went on I was becoming sad about the stagnancy that's when I had to sorry that's when I realized that I wasn't making so much progress i thought I, I was going to be on youtube and in a matter of six months it was going to be all rosy which was in the story i came back again to start afresh in september 2019 i emptied my bank account my savings got new filming gears furnished my room and got products being skeptical i said highest i will fail and i'll start over again so as you all know i I don't let failure get to me because I feel failure is part of a person's life. At some point you fail at something just because you have to use another method to get to your end point or to get to the result you're looking for. So for me, I feel failure is just a, it's just a, what will I call it? A stop for you to take another turn for you to do something else instead of going the, the, the same way. So that's what happened to me right now my growth is encouraging but still at a snail pace for me which is still okay it's still okay for now because this is not what i envision my growth growth to be like by now then i realized i had a major weight weight loss goal and i achieved it so if you're new here you will know that in 2019 the beginning of 2019 i was really huge i was very big and i had a goal like that was my only goal my only goal was to lose weight and i set that goal and i accomplished it and i said to myself if i can set that goal and i accomplish it and i accomplish this goal i mean it means that any goal i set for myself if i am determined and i put in the work i am meant to put in on my path i am going to definitely achieve this goal firstly i would like to start for my plan for 2020 so i'm here to share my plans for 2020 so in any way you can support me in any way you can push me to reach my goals in any way you can motivate me you any way you can inspire me nothing is too small so here it is for my goals youtube i'm looking to gaining 100 subscribers by the end of this year it might sound really really unrealistic because people are like mm, 100k i mean somebody said aim for the stars and you land on the moon or aim, aim for the moon and you land on the stars somewhere at the back of my mind i'm aiming for 20. also in school if you're about to write an exam they say if you aim for an a you get a b if you aim for a b you get a c or you might get a c so if i aim for 100 it means i'm going to get something close to 100 so yeah it's not just outrageous it is realistic i believe in the power of positive speaking and i believe in possibility mentality so if you believe something is possible if everything in your mind works together to achieve a goal and you are putting in the work you just don't have to sit down and think about it you have to put in that work when, once you put in that work i believe you will achieve it if not you will you will achieve something really close to it or even surpass your goal and yes i have failed before because i have tried this 
another way and it didn't result to anything and that is in the past now i am in the future where in the future the future is now and failure is past tense i mean put i'm putting that failure behind me now and i'm moving forward so that means that everything that has happened before is in the past and right now uh, i am in the future and i am going to make that change i am going to make it worth my time i am going to make it worth my stress my energy and and everything so if you are wondering what i mean by i i have failed it means that it has happened and right now i am moving forward doing better and i'm going to be fine i am going to get get it done right this time around if you have anything you've been pursuing for a very long time and it doesn't seem to get into your grease or your grasp or your hands or you don't seem to get it on right now just remember that everything takes time and with time everything is going to be fine everything is going to get to you and just be patient so don't freak out don't be in a hurry take your time be very patient and every lesson learned in whatever situation now in whatever step you take is very very important so keep up the good work and make sure your heart is where your brain is or your brain is where your heart is either of the two but i want to attend at least a hill song concert i've been praying for them to come to nigeria for so long either hill song jesus culture or elevation worship either of them but most likely hill song because i really would love hill song i love gospel music and i would really love to attend their concerts i want to work with a lot of brands both nigerian and international brands meanwhile you guys are not ready for nigerian brands especially the makeup brands they are not joking in this industry at all especially in nigeria makeup brands are doing so much this time around at least five to 10 brands a month for other aspects which includes one my love life as you all know i am single i am definitely not searching for now and along the line in the year 2020 if a boyfriend comes fine if he doesn't come fine either way i am fine but if he comes he should definitely not stress me he should definitely not put pressure on me he should allow me breathe and I mean, it's not one of my priorities for now, so yeah. Number two, I would love to give back to anybody I can give back to, and uh, not just the needy, not just the poor. I want to give back to people who have dreams, people who want to do stuff, but they don't have things to start with, especially people in the makeup industry who are just starting and they don't have products, they don't have things to do, and they have interest in the makeup um the makeup industry and maybe makeup artistry or something but they don't have tools to use they don't have um products to use so if you have any of these things that you don't need we can come together and give to them so you can help them pursue their dreams and this will go a long way in their life and they will in their lives and they will never ever forget you so not just the poor not just the needy but also people who have dreams but do not have ways of accomplishing them because i remember when i just started my own makeup journey i i did not have products and products were really expensive still expensive but thank god for grace right now i can afford most products i need to buy to make content so yeah please if you have means of giving back to or giving to people like this please do not hesitate to give them or we can come together and give to them three i would love to quit public transportation i mean the days of bus should be over by now but you see that okada i love okada so much because it's so fast and gets me to my destination in time so i'm going to try and quit public transportation so god help me and also i would love to save more i mean i am already big on saving like I, I i can almost say i am addicted to saving because any money i have if i know i don't need to spend it if there's something i don't need to get i save it immediately and there's an account i keep separately where i don't have a banking app i don't have an atm card for it and i use that for my saving alone so yeah i would love to save more so i can invest in big things 
and so on and so forth and to also put my future together so this video is kind of summing up my journey through um 2017 and 2019 and trying to you know just put i put it out there that even if you are doing something now which isn't worth it or which is looking like it's not worth it it's not over I, I i truly believe i i love this part that i am this path rather i truly believe i love this path i am and i have so much interest in it for you to be consistent in something you need to have interest so yeah you you need to have interest in it so if you have interest in something it comes natural to you to do things you're meant to do because most times when people start youtube channels they think it's all rosy and in a matter of two months you get paid i haven't been paid a penny since i started youtube in the year 2017 and this is 2020 it's three years already so failure to me is a a a a sign that i should do things differently so most of you notice i have switched up my channel if you were watching my videos in 20, 2017 and you watch my videos now you'll notice i have switched things up in my on my channel or in my channel i do a mix of both lifestyle both makeup and lifestyle i do a lot because i have so much to give i mean i do so many things and i just wonder is it only makeup i put on this on youtube channel it's not possible i am talented i am creative i am gifted and i have so much to offer to so many of you who watch me sincerely who keep who keep your notification on and i just feel i i just feel i need to share a lot with so much with, oh my god i just feel i need to share so much with all of you because you guys are so true especially especially if you you've been watching me from 2017 up till this moment i really appreciate your presence here that's what i keep saying that i will never take your presence here for granted if you've been watching me since 2017 so i would just like to put this out there that if you're doing something which you are sure of which you have interest your interest is so important your interest and your consistency is so important so if you're doing something and you have true interest and you can keep up with your consistency even if nobody is noticing you now keep doing it one day you will get noticed and everything will be fine everything is going to be fine everything is going to be worth it so please do not quit do not say you are tired keep the good work if you love this video if you loved what you just watched please give this video a thumbs up and remember to subscribe to my youtube channel and turn on your post notification bell so you get and um, so you get a notification whenever i upload a video and also if you love to see this makeup look that i have on i have it in my instagram or on my instagram feed as a video or a short video on my Insta on my Instagram so you can check my Instagram for this look I have on if you're interested in it and thank you so much for watching this video guys I really really appreciate you guys and I hope to see you in my next video thank you so much and have a blessed day Mwah.